Hello, my name is Jo. In this video, I'll show you how to get the most out of the to-do and shopping list features in the Life Sorted app. The to-do list is easily accessed from the menu. You can choose to view your family's to-do list in a way that works best for you. To-dos are currently displayed here in the list view. You can tap on this icon to view your to-do and shopping lists by due date. And this icon will display any to-dos marked as completed or done. Tap on the triangle icon to collapse and expand your lists. You can also show and hide tasks for individual family members by tapping on them here. Now, there are two ways to add a to-do. Let's take a look. Either click on the plus icon on the list you want to add a task to, or click the plus button here in the bottom right corner. Now, let's add a task to the around the house list. What is the task? Clean the pool. When is it due? You can specify a due date or leave this set to someday. This needs to be done on Sunday. What list does this belong to? Around the house, outside. Who's assigned? Dad. Tick to save and we're done. Dad will be notified that this task has been added and also on the due date. When a task is completed, it can be ticked off or deferred to the next day if it just didn't get done. Now let's talk shopping lists. Shared shopping lists are so brilliant. Everyone can add to the list as they notice things that are running low. And you can even create sublists for different stores, making it easy to see what is needed at a glance. Let's add a few items to the shopping list. You can enter multiple items at once, like this. Select who's assigned. and click Done to save. When you or another member of your family visits the store and ticks items off the shopping list, they will disappear, letting everyone else know. Hopefully this video has given you some ideas on how you and your family could make the most of to-do and shopping lists in Life Sorted. Thanks for watching.